In today's video, we'll talk about how to get back the old start menu in Windows 11 using Start 11. Myself, Mohammed Zubair, and this channel is all about showing you how to become a highly paid IT pro really fast. So without any further ado, let's get started. Microsoft launched Windows 11 with a new Start menu. Unlike the previous versions of Microsoft Windows, the Start menu button and other application icons are in the middle of the taskbar by default, as you can see. They have also changed the design and layout of the Start menu button, which resembles a lot with Windows 10X. Well, if you do not like to adapt to new changes or do not like this change at all, and in case if you need the old style start menu, we have got you covered. For that, we need to download the start 11 first. This is the official website of StarDoc, and from here you can download the start 11. But the problem is, you cannot download it for free from here. You have to pay for it. But we have an alternative website known as Softpedia, and here we also have the same StarDoc start 11. You just need to download it and everything is free. Only thing that you need to do is you have to start the free trial for 30 days and you have to activate your account by adding the email address when you are done after installation of Start 11. So now let's have a demo and let's see how Start 11 works and how we can get back the old start menu. This is the first screen that you will get after the installation process is done. From here, you have two options. As we all know that in old style menu like Windows 7 or Vista, we had this style towards the left side. I'll go with left aligned and I will click on OK. And as you can see, everything has just shifted towards the left side. And here we have some of the menu style that we can go with. In case if you want to have the old Windows 7 style, you can go with this one. Then you have Windows 10 style and you have a modern style. It will resemble just like the Windows 7, but it will have modern look. I'll show you both of these. So now I have selected Windows 7 and here you can see I have everything just like we used to have in Windows 7. Let's go with the modern style and let's see. Here you can see now we have the latest touch. Now let's try the Windows 10 style. And this time if I click on my start menu button, here you can see I have all the start menu and all the layout with interface of Windows 10 style menu. So this is how you can select a style for your start menu. I'll stick with Windows 7 and now let's move on to the start button. At the moment, use a custom start button image is disabled. If you just enable this option, it will give you a lot of option to choose from. Here you have a lot of icons or you can say a lot of images that you can set for your start button. Then you have your position, the start button in the center of the taskbar. Well, in case if you want to position this one in the center of your taskbar, but as we have changed it and we want the Windows 7 old style, that is why we'll stay with the left side. Then we have some of the options that we can do with Windows taskbar. For example, we can have some of the options related to taskbar blur, transparency and color. If we disable the first option, our taskbar will become transparent and we can see the whole background on our screen. But in case if you want to have your taskbar differentiated with your background, just enable this option back. Then we have use automatic color for the taskbar. It means it will adjust its color on its own as per the background of your desktop. Here you can see now it has the black color and now it has adjusted on its own. Then you have some of the taskbar settings related to its transparency. You can increase the opaqueness or you can decrease it as well. So you have to just set the value. Then you can apply some of the custom texture to your taskbar. For example, use a custom text background texture. If you turn this on, here you have some of the options that you can apply onto your taskbar. As you can see, we have successfully changed it. I'm okay with the default one, so I will not change it. Then you have some other options that you can go through. And that was all about it. I'll go back. And down here, we have some other option like control what right clicking on the taskbar does. Well, we all know that if we right click on our start button, it opens some of the menus. 
here we have some of the option that we can control with right clicking if i right click on my start now it will open the windows plus x menu here it is but now if you want to disable this one you just need to disable this option then we have replaced taskbar right click menu with windows 10 style one it is also enabled at the moment you can disable it if you want then you have some of the option related to your taskbar size then you have your taskbar position then you have some other option now comes to the search part it says you start 11 search in the start 11 start menu it is enabled at the moment if i disable this one and if i click on my start button here we do not have any search area i will enable this option again and now if i click here here you can see we have the search area here and if you remember in windows 7 we also used to have this search area and you can search for anything for example if i search for cmd and here you can see it is working just like any windows operating system version then you have how should search work you can tweak some of the settings related to your search like filtering icons then search file content as well as their names then you have search for shortcuts on the desktop and in fences other than that you have some other settings that you can go through and you can set them as per your own liking at the end we have the control section well if you click on start button it will open your start 11 menu what you can do you can change it to windows menu or windows menu unless dock start 11 menu unless in tablet mode i'll stick with the default option because i'm okay with it then you have show the windows menu when control click the start button well if you control click on your start button it will show you the windows menu here you can see now we have the windows 11 start menu but if i just click on the start button without pressing the control it will open the old style menu if you want to disable this option you can do so other than that we also have some of the option to choose with pressing the windows key and you can change it as per your liking then you have in a full screen application pressing the windows key open start 11 menu obviously if you open any application let's say i'm opening my file explorer and if i press my windows key it will open my menu if you want to change it you can have other things as well for example i want to open windows menu not the start 11 menu so now if i press my windows key it has just opened the windows menu earlier it was opening the start 11 menu then at the end you have one more option that says pin windows menu shortcut on start 11 menu you can disable this one as well as per your liking and at the end we have the about section and it is all about the start 11 tool or application and that brings us to the end of today's video i hope now that you must have liked this one so please leave a like subscribe and press the bell icon we'll see you in the next video till then take care